All right, boss. And you see him just get annihilated. What's up, guys? War here. Welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm bringing you my rogue twisted blades build it's absolutely insane it does so much damage you're up close and personal and most of all you're super super fast so let's go over everything you need to absolutely annihilate everything that you come up against so we're starting off with puncture this gives us a uh, blaze that we throw a short distance and we're taking it all the way up to fundamental so when we hit somebody twice we make them vulnerable then we're going to come down and take twisting blades make sure you take five points into this guys we're going to grab enhanced twisting blades for more damage and then we're grabbing advanced twisting blades so with that way when we dash away or shadow step away the blades return to us and reduce our cooldowns through and do even more damage so we're going to sort on down to our agility skills and this is where the bread and butter is going to be after hitting twisting blades we have shadow step up to enhanced shadow step so that way we have an increase in our critical strike damage against them when we shadow step and then the, also our other agility ability is going to be dash with one node in there for enhanced dash so enemies that take damage by dash take 20 percent increased critical strike damage from us for five seconds this is great now we're going to skip down to suffrage or saboteur fridge <laughs> we don't have anything in that or excuse me yeah we do we have exploit one rank and then we have two ranks in malice so that way we deal even more damage against vulnerable enemies because every monster we should be fighting is vulnerable then we come down and we take uh shadow step with uh shadow imbuement uh we have enhanced shadow step or shadow imbuement excuse me and then blended shadow imbuement so that way we make them vulnerable and then when they blow up they make other enemies vulnerable then we have shadow crash guys just for more damage but we come up here this is the most important one consuming shadows where each time we kill an enemy with shadow damage we generate more energy so then we come down and we take the our ultimate shadow clone so this is going to mimic everything that we do from our shadow uh so everything that we do our shadows do they deal 80 percent of our damage because we have prime shadow clone for makes us unstoppable and then the shadow clone deals an additional 20 percent, which makes our 80 so they're going to do everything that we do plus some and do some incredible damage so that's the layout guys how this build works is we go in we hit puncture at least twice make them vulnerable we hit them with blades and then we can use our um agility skills to dash away and the blades are going to do a crap ton of damage but we want to hit shadow imbuement on top of these so we hit them twice shadow imbuement uh twisting blades and then we dash away rinse and repeat and then when we're on a boss like we're about to do now we are going to be doing uh shadow clone so let's go hit it let's go let's go let's go let's go kill this boss man i have not fought a boss with this yet so guys you're gonna see it first hands here we're gonna go in and kill everything in here first and uh you'll see how it goes let's get it Uh, uh. We're, we're gonna hold our ultimate. We're gonna hold our ultimate, guys. We're gonna hold our ultimate. Oops. Easy peasy. All right, boss. And you see him just get annihilated! <sighs> guys. Guys. I don't know if you saw what just happened, but that just happened. Okay? It just it just happened right there. All right. Now that we have the showcase done, let's go over some of the key gear pieces that you need to dominate with this build okay the main and most important one guys is twisting blades orbit for a short time after they return to you dealing 28 percent uh damage of twisting blades damage return per hit based on the distance that they return to you it increases up to 56 percent this is where we get such a huge damage boost against these bosses against the enemies as we're dashing around or we're shadow stepping around this is the main one Okay, now I'm going to go over all the other ones that I have really have. None of these really contribute. They they help, but they're nothing that you really need. So Shadow Step gets additional charge after we kill an enemy. That's okay. Basic skills give us damage reduction, which is awesome. Fast Penetrating Shot has nothing to do with the build. 
We gain a dark free or dark shadow uh, every three seconds, which is good. Gives us more damage reduction. Then we have a lucky hit from Marksman. Still doesn't do anything. Then we have rapid fire. Doesn't do anything. Then we have, you have 18% increased critical strike chance against injured enemies, which means when they're below 35% of their health, which is huge. This helps us just finish off bosses. And then that's Marksman skills too. So uh, our two weapons, we have making an enemy vulnerable, which we always make them vulnerable has a 46% chance to give us 3% increased critical strike chance for three seconds up to 9%. This is also what helps us hit with critical strikes. Then we have when we dash, we just get another clone as we're dashing, which is the one you see behind me. So really the only ones that really mainly contribute to this build is this one you have to have for twisting blades and then lucky hit making them having more crit chance. Otherwise it's all this guys. There is some other abilities that I would like to have on the build like attacking faster so that way we proc this faster and then hit this faster but there's there's only a few other things there's like one other item that increases your critical uh strike chance which is huge but the build works phenomenal without it guys so that is the twisting blades build like the video if you guys have enjoyed it comment down below what do you guys think i'm sure there's a lot of other twisting blades out there because it's one of the strongest builds right now that i've seen uh other people being using so yeah guys like the video subscribe and as always, stay gaming. Catch you guys in the next one. Peace.